best way that we can show you that we want to take care of you is to show you that we're going to take care of your family as well. I picked a meet with Jimmy at a gentleman's club. We're going to be working with Jimmy in Diddy Studio with one of the top industry producers. How you doing? Hey, hey, hello. Wow, how are you? All right. My name's Greg. What's up, Greg D. Angeletti? How are you? I know. Nice to meet you. Hi, Lauren. Hi, Lauren. How nice are you? you? Good. You want to sit down? I mean, D. Dot's a legend. He cut one of 50 Cent's first records. He worked with Biggie. Well, first, I want to say it's a huge pleasure to meet you. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Heard about you for years. Yeah. And uh, don't make me sound too old, though, please. <laughs> nah, nah I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm, I want to, you know, a lot of respect, man. Nah, Seriously. I appreciate that. Thank uh, you so much. We have an artist called Jimmy Cross in the Mob. He's like a, a rock slash hip hop artist, and he likes to call his music like gangsta punk. Gangsta punk. And together it's gunk. Gunk, okay. Gunk. It's a first verse, a B section, no chorus. Second verse, B section, and then a chorus. That's what it sounds like to me. Like this, nothing going on right here, right? Mm -hmm. Two, three, four. Now it sounds like a chorus should be right. Just so miserable. I'm just so miserable. Maybe going, or maybe not, but this is the second verse, right? Okay. You think we'd be able to incorporate hip hop in this at all? I mean, we can incorporate hip hop into anything. It's okay. just how how deep we want to go with it. Yeah. All right, cool. So I mean, we good. You know what I mean? So right, we'll cool. come back as soon as as soon as Jimmy gets here. We'll rock. Hey, what's up, what's up man? What's up, baby? Right on. How are you? D. Dot Angeletti. D. How are you? What is? Hi, I'm Kelly. Hello. It's how a are pleasure. you, my darling? Very right. Good. This is Kevin, the engineer. Kevin. Kevin. We gonna do a little combination today. I think we gonna try to do a combination. Hip rock. Yeah, that's rock what I really want. That's rock hop. Right. I'm, I'm with you. I had thought about like a um, like a da 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 uh uh. Uh -uh. You know what I mean? Something like that, where it's like, I mean, I got a bill, she never satisfied. It sound real like, right. Uh, you want to right. Do right. Like, real. Yes. Hey, right. you want to keep it more like, exactly. a little I wanna, more rugged. I wanna, exactly. Yeah. I want to I wanna get real rugged with it. Later on, we got to work with D Dot in the studio with Jimmy. Working at Diddy's studio, dream come true, man. You come in the house, you want on the couch, running your mouth, and then you want to kick a mother out. The time I nah, spent the money for rock and roll. Right? Up on the mic, you don't understand. <laughs> that shit sound like you in a concert in mud. Greg was laid back and said, you know, this is your song. You came up with it already. I think it's hot, and I'm gonna let you do it. You do. The way I look at it is Jimmy recorded Miserable without me. We made this version more live, more amp, more hype. To me, I want the artist to set me up a little bit. When that verse come on, I want to, I really want to get excited. You know what I'm saying? Okay. <laughs> Nancy was more vocal in his approach and definitely more aggressive and wanted to see shit happen. I know that our team came in with some very clear ideas of where we wanted to go, so I think that helped us. We got a song, right? We do one perfectly imperfect. At the end of the day, it doesn't make any sense to reproduce the same song over again when you're sitting in the studio with multi-platinum producers. It's like, why not come up with something new and something creative? Like right now, it's like, I mean, I got a girl, she's never satisfied, and then, but I wanna. Uh, Yancey you know, he wants to make sure he's heard and he has a certain opinion on what he thinks his audience is for, for Jimmy, you know what I'm saying? So I like that. Why can't you, why, you know what I mean, or something like that. Why 
Nancy is doing an awesome job today. He is not sitting back and taking a watching role. He's actively participating in the arrangement. You double up on the drums. Got you. Like, do 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 And how the vocals sound. You got a couple yeah, verses yeah, from the song. Yeah, I got all of yeah, all the verses. You're gonna do the verses of the song, and this is gonna come in somewhere. And how the instrumentation is going. Yo, you're gonna double it, and then on the triple, you're gonna talk it out at the bottom, just like you did on the verse. Yancey yeah, pushed some buttons. He got on my nerves at times, just because he wanted to be so hands-on about his approach. And they told us to come in and produce a hit, so I had an idea of, of, of kind of the vision that I wanted to roll with. So why can't you, why can't you be just like me? Why can't you be what just like me? You know, hopefully it'll be a hit, we'll see. I think the session went great, you know. Jimmy had a lot of energy and he was really feeling the song and you know, all the ideas that D-Dot was giving him. And Even the rap part, that could go over this. Yeah, definitely. You know what I'm saying? That could be you like, whoa, we cracked the flow, we cracked the flow, we cracked it. Greg, he doesn't seem to me to be aggressively, you know, taking charge as an A&R and executive in the studio. Unorthodox, not constant rhyming, kind of unorthodox. A little splash here, a little splash there. That could work too. Greg, at the only point I think he let me down when he fell asleep and everybody was tired as hell, but he was asleep. That only kind of irritated me a little something, you know, but. made history in there and I, it was hot. I loved it. I'm absolutely surprised Greg has gotten this far. Greg has the all around qualities to be um, the CEO of a record label. I would definitely work with Yancey again, but I could never work for Yancey. Yancey should win this.